Hi, I'm William Everhart, Director of Training here at Lodestone, and I've got another Photoshop quick tip for you. If you're like me, you like to use masks, especially when it comes to adjustment layers. Well, over here on the right, I have an adjustment layer that is applying a hue saturation to this photo. I have a mask applied to it, and that's all fine and well. Maybe I want to see the mask, so I'll turn that mask on so I can see it. But notice that the color of the mask is red. Well, that's okay in here because it's a pretty bright red, but I do have some red apples here that I might want to remove the mask from. It might be a better choice if my mask was a different color. Now I can do that. If I take a look over here in the Layers panel, up at the top I have my Channels panel. And if I switch to that, because I have my mask active, it is listed right here as Hue Saturation 1 Mask. To change the color of it, I simply double click on that channel. I get a layer mask display option, and there's a little color chip right there. Click the color chip, pick your color, tell it OK. Now, you also have this thing called opacity. Adjust this as well. The lower the opacity, the more see through, obviously. And that is really good when you have areas that are really, really dark, say shadowy areas. A low opacity for your mask is great. Really bright highlight areas, skies and things like that, a higher opacity may help you out there as well. So I'll just click OK here and you'll see now it turns to blue. It's very apparent now as to where my mask is and where it is not. I can add to, take away from this mask, do whatever it is I normally do. It's just in blue. Well, that's it for this quick tip. See you next time. Thank you for watching. For more quick tips or more in-depth training, please go to www.lodestone.com.